hello everyone welcome back in this video we will see including and importing files for large playbooks so here uh, when a playbook gets longer or complex we can divide it up into smaller files to make it easier to manage and we can also combine multiple playbooks into a main playbook and uh, or we can also insert a list of tasks from a file into the play and this way we can you know make it uh, easier to reuse plays or sequence of tasks in different project okay so now uh, let us create some task and playbook separately and then we can uh, include uh, those tasks and import those tasks into a main playbook so i'm going to create a folder called complex and cd into that okay here i'm going to create a task install dot yaml name install package module yum for name i'm just going to use the variable package state present okay and uh, next let me create service dot yaml And here start and enable the service using the service module and for name of the module I'm going to again use the variable state and enable okay and uh, the next one firewall.yaml okay here getting firewall access firewall d module service we can use variable okay and state enabled immediate this permanent yes okay so the next one create dot yaml okay create web page here i'm going to use the copy module content again some variable and destination war dub 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 html index dot html file okay and uh, next we'll create some test dot yaml is going to be the playbook 
here we are going to testing web server on host i'm going to use the dev group and task name just testing uri so the url going to be url variable and some return content yes status code 200 okay so next i'm going to create a master playbook deploy.yaml and uh, here name will be includes and imports task and playbooks it's going to be on dev group so task first we will include task install.yaml and uh, let's give the vars detail here the package going to be httpd and next we can use the import task okay here import the service.yaml and you can provide the vars here that is http d and uh, next let's use the include task for firewall.yaml and we can supply the variables here firewall service going to be http and uh, next we are going to import task create dot yaml and here the wars going to be content welcome to ansible course okay and uh, next let's include the playbook testing so here we will import the playbook start yaml and the words going to be url http colon server8.acg.com okay let me save and exit now let me run the playbook and simple playbook deploy dot yaml okay let me try other way okay now we are running the playbook
Okay, so here we can see that uh, the main playbook has completed successfully. It includes the task and installing the package. And uh, here you can see that uh, the other task and playbook. So now uh, let me just uh, run the curl HTTP server.acg.com. And here we can see that uh, welcome to Ansible course. Okay, so uh, in this way, we can, you know, divide the big, you know, the big playbook into the smaller one. So, for example, if I cat deploy.yaml, this is the main playbook, but we are also importing and in including the other playbook that's in this location. Okay, so that's it in this video and I'll see you in the next.